Welcome to Research Rocks. In this video, we will see one of the interesting video comes from ChatGPT. Now, upcoming features introducing by face-to-face -face ChatGPT. How to use, where is available. We will see detailed demonstration in this video. Before start the video, please subscribe our YouTube channel Research Rocks. So look at this here. Couple of minutes ago, I am receiving this email. An email su subject is a talk face-to-face -face with ChatGPT in real time. That is really amazing. Our new free web app chat D ID is available. So face to face conversation is going on. Such kind of beautiful lady talk with you. That is really amazing. I just simply click here and look at this here. Such kind of web page is display here front of your eyes. Your even I already added this link in video description. You just click and come to the here. Before start anything, we need to sign in first of all. As a sign in point of view here, Gmail address or LinkedIn. So I go with simply in Gmail address. So now we can ask here something. Now just simply tell me about how I travel Copenhagen to Zurich, Switzerland. The alias are providing you which types of output we are receiving here. Sure, I'd be happy to help you plan your trip from Copenhagen to Zurich. There are a few different transportation options available, so let's take a look at each one. One, flights. You can catch a flight from Copenhagen Airport, CPH, to Zurich Airport, CRH, with several airlines, including Swiss, SAS, and Lufthansa. The flight takes around 1.5 hours, and there are usually several flights per day. 2. Trains. Another option is to take a train from Copenhagen Central Station to Zurich Hauptbahnhof. This journey will take you through Germany and can take anywhere from 12 to 15 hours, depending on the train connections. You'll need to change trains at least once, and possibly more depending on your route. 3. Driving. If you prefer to drive, you can rent a car in Copenhagen and drive to Zurich. So look at this. You can receive here answer as a voice format like okay, one more question I'm asking here. Can you please explain linear regression providing the answer little late? Linear regression is a statistical method used to analyze the relationship between two continuous variables. It is used to model the relationship between a dependent variable, also called the response variable, and one or more independent variables, also called predictor variables. Linear regression can be used for both simple linear regression with only one. It's really amazing here. You can copy your chat and share. Sign out options are available. Start new conversation here. And here is my profile. After five chat, four chat are left. After that, they are providing some of the package related information. Pricing here, pricing is available. 14 days zero. After that, some of the options are available. But if you are paying like a $6 per month, it's very cheap about like a $6 per month and you can talk with continuously 10 minute, 15 minute and 65 minutes accordingly how much money you are paying. It's really amazing features introducing by DID.com. If you really like this video, so please hit the bell icon, share this video and subscribe our YouTube channel Research Rock. Till then, Jai Hind, Vande Mataram.